Hello everyone, welcome to Easy Duo and today we are going to solve this numerical. A roller coaster car starts its journey from a vertical height of 40 meter. We will calculate the thermal energy produced and we will estimate the average frictional force on the car. Okay, the given data is height 1. The roller coaster car starts its journey from this height 1 and then it goes toward this height which is 25 meter it starts its free falling from here and then gaining the momentum it comes back to the height of 25 meter and then stops here the numerical state that we have to calculate the thermal energy that is produced during this motion due to the fractional force so this is a pretty simple straightforward numerical the height h1 is 40 meter the height h2 this height is 25 meter mass of the roller coaster is given as 1000 kilogram and the total distance traveled by the roller coaster is 400 meter and we also know that the gravitational constant is 9.8 meter per second square now we are going to calculate first the potential energy at this height we know that potential energy is mgh so we will take height 1 this h1 and substitute the value for mass gravity and height 1 in this equation and solving we will get this result then we will substitute the, uh, the values for mg and this time we are going to substitute the value for h2 which will give us the potential energy at this second peak now this was the initial potential energy at height h1 and this is the second potential energy at height h2 now during this motion a lot of potential energy is lost and that potential energy which is lost is converted into the thermal energy so for calculating that thermal energy we will simply subtract the potential energy at height h2 from the potential energy at height h1 so we have p1 minus p2 subtracting this value we will get 147,000 joule this is the energy or the potential energy which is lost during this motion and this potential energy is converted into thermal energy due to the fractional force now the second part of the numerical is estimate the average fractional force on the car so for doing this now we know that the energy that is lost during this motion is 147,000, which is actually the work done and from the work done equation we know that the work done is equal to f multiplied by distance travel or the force times distance but here we are using this force the force we know which resulted in the thermal energy is the fractional force so we will solve this equation for uh, force which is fr the fractional force is equal to work done multiplied by distance traveled now we know the distance travel is uh, 400 meter which is given in the numerical and we also know the energy that is lost during this uh, motion the thermal energy is 1000 of 147,000 dividing this 147,000 by 400 meter we will get 367.5 newton and this is the fractional force on the car whose mass is 1000 kilogram that's it thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe easy to you for more videos